What's up YouTube? Uh, back here doing uh, another review, Octane Militia. We bought these uh, Super ATV rock sliders not that long ago. Um, they're pretty fair in price. Uh, so we decided to go with these because they just look like they are uh, pretty high-end quality. When I looked on YouTube though, there wasn't very many reviews on them. So uh, I figured I'd do a review on them. Um, first impression when I got them out of the box was they're kind of heavy, you know. Um, you know we're always trying to save weight for power here um, but then when I took them out uh, installed them and everything I am so glad that I bought them and that they were as heavy as they are because they are rugged they are rugged as hell and they can take a beating um, so this is just the outside it's a it's all very thick coated steel it's powder coated uh, it stays pretty rugged um, if you look underneath here though uh, this big ass metal piece of plate right here comes with it, which uh, doesn't say it in much of the descriptions, but that protects it all the way down the side from wheel to wheel, which is absolutely awesome because I've <laughs> I have definitely caught myself on some rocks hitting that thing, which your gas tank on the other side is directly under there. So on both sides, you've got this real thick, thick steel. It's probably quarter inch uh, steel plates that go all the way down across, um, and then it's also paired up with these bad Larry's right here, which are also really, really rugged. So uh, I've got nothing but good things to, to say about them. They, uh, they definitely look very uh, classy. They're smooth on the machine, and the install was very easy. Um, when you first get it, uh, right here across, there's a piece of plastic, which is absolutely, it's super flimsy, it's trash, it's no good at all. So I just took a chisel, snapped off all the rivets holding it on, and then you get a little plate, the plate will hide up in here in this little hole, and then you'll have four uh, places to thread into when you want to put the thread in there. That's it. That's all it's to it is four bolts front and rear. Uh, two that hold on uh, the uh, the slider, and then two that hold on the big plate underneath. But um, like I said, at first I thought they were heavy, but now that looking the beating that they've taken and what they've done, um, I absolutely love them. I think they're great. Um, very good product, very well made, and I would, if I had to go through it all over again, I would not change. I would definitely buy these again because of the quality and the performance that I have seen them do. Um, plus, they're really not bad as far as looks go. If you step back to my machine, um, they blend in very, very well with the uh, the tubing on the rest of the machine, including the doors and uh, the, fr the pre-runner front bumper that I'm running. So, uh, like I said, nothing but good things to say about them. They're not that expensive. I want to say they were about 300 bucks. Don't quote me on that. <clears throat> I did buy them quite a while ago, but uh, I'm trying to do reviews on things because when you go to search YouTube, there's just not a hell of a lot of reviews for anything on the Can-Am. So every time I put something on, I'm going to take and uh, do a review on it. But uh, if you're thinking about buying these, well worth the price. I would definitely think they are extremely well made. They look a little classier than the uh, competition, and they're extremely rugged. Probably, probably some of the most rugged ones out there, for sure. That, that steel plate on the bottom has saved my ass uh, probably three or four times now. It doesn't matter whether it's rocks, stumps, just anything. It, it just does absolutely phenomenal. So nothing but good things to say. Uh, thanks for watching. I know this is a short review, but... Um, I just wanted you guys to know that I think it's a great product and uh, I'd highly recommend getting it. Um, thanks for watching. Tune in for more videos. Uh, should be uploads weekly. Don't forget to subscribe.